Welcome to Philips Ultrasound. Today, breast cancer is second most common form of the cancer in the world. And many clinicians, they rely on mammography for breast cancer screening. But for the women with the dense breast tissue, it becomes extremely harder to pick up the smaller cancerous lesions on mammogram. And this makes the diagnosis more difficult. So in this challenging scenario, ultrasound can give a better image clarity. And this is where Philips comes into the picture. So Philips, anatomical intelligence for breast, which is also known as AI breast, can facilitate breast examination by preserving the superb image quality for full diagnostic. AI breast is a very powerful software that utilizes the EL184 transducer. This transducer has a built-in electromagnetic tracker that works in conjunction with tabletop electromagnetic field generator that is mounted inside a specially designed mattress. You can use this mattress for screening as well as for diagnostic exams. You press the anatomical intelligence for breast on the touch screen and then it opens up into this particular screen. As you can see on the graphic, the system tells you to identify certain landmarks. You can identify these landmarks in just few seconds and then the system is ready to scan. So now what I'm going to do is, I'm going to perform the scan by scanning the breast in side-to-side -side fashion. So while I'm moving the transducer, I'm also acquiring the loops. As you can see on the screen, AI breast allows the visual mapping of the screen anatomy. And this helps in documenting the full coverage of the breast. Also, while I'm acquiring these images, if you see any particular pathology, you can quickly bookmark that particular image for a quick review at a later stage. So once I complete the entire breast area, I'm going to pull out one of the loops that I have acquired. I can scroll through the loops, I can get a particular image, and in this image, as you can see, there is a pathology. Now in normal case, when you are using a conventional system, you will have to label this pathology manually. But on Philips system, with AI breast, there is a feature called auto annotation. Just with the one click, the system can label this image. At this point, if I want to have an orthogonal view of this particular pathology, with just one click, the system can give me an orthogonal view and it can display both the perpendicular views in side-by-side -side format. AI breast helps to enhance the workflow, it helps to eliminate the labeling errors, and it can help to increase the departmental efficiency. AI breast also has another feature that is reverse lookup. Reverse lookup can help you to find any frame into the acquired loop. So for example, if I want to look at the image in this region of interest, by moving the caliper on that area, the system will show me that particular frame from the acquired loop. The another advantage of AI breast is, it is completely integrated into your ultrasound system. There is no need for an additional equipment or no need for an additional space in an ultrasound room. The EL184 transducer that I used for this particular demo is pure wave ultra broadband linear transducer that generates a very fine elevation focusing. And this helps to get a very uniform, excellent image quality from near field to the far field. This transducer also supports the complete elastography solution that is strain and elastic cube, shear wave imaging. So to conclude, Philips offers a tailored clinical tools as a part of ultimate ultrasound solution for breast assessment. And this can help clinicians to achieve a confident diagnosis. Last but not least, AI Breast is available on Epic and Affinity 70 ultrasound systems.